Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube Prep Lab channel. And uh, today we are going to discuss question number five. That's question number challenge. We have started Prep Lab 100 IP math question challenge. So uh, let's go to the flight number five and uh, let's see. Okay, so today challenge is about function and function is also one of the most important topic of IBA Karachi. So you must see this is the past papers question and idea is that, so let's read out. Suppose f of x, it's a function x cubed plus 5x squared minus 6x. And then second function, which is g of x is equal to 2x squared minus 5x minus 31. Then they are asking which of the following polynomial is divisible by x minus two. Okay, so we have given two function and then we have to find if it is divided divisible by x minus two, it means that it will be equal to zero. It will be equally divided. That's why there is no remainder. So it means that when these two function will be divided by x minus two, the remainder will be zero. So what we have to do, we know that if it is divided by x minus two, so we will write down x minus two is equal to zero. So x is equal to zero. So now we have to do, we have to put the value of f of x as f of t. x cube plus 5x square minus 6 okay so we have to uh, put the value mm, okay so f of 2 okay so that will become 2 cube 8 5 into 4 20 and minus 6 so that is equal to 28 that is 22 now same put the value on gfx so, 2 square minus 5 into 2 minus 31 okay so that will become 2 into 4 that is 8 and 5 into 2 minus 10 and the minus 31 so that is 31 minus 41 minus 41 plus 8 minus 32 so now the option is given in like we have to we know that if it is divided by exponent the value will become zero so just put the value in that function for example if you are putting the value of a in that i am cutting this down so here two you have find the value of f of x which is equal to 22 minus and you have so that will become that will uh, 66 minus 99 that is not equal to zero so that's will option will not be no so it's not equal to zero same it goes for this function that will also not be equal to this minus into minus plus that will equal not be and if you very well 3 into 22 minus 4 into minus 33 so that will become 66 so 1 minus 132 will not equal to 0 now put the value in that function so that into 66 minus 60 which is equal to 0 so this option is satisfying because this option is getting divided by x minus 2. So that's it. This is the question number 4. Just watch it again and don't forget to subscribe to the PayPal YouTube channel and stay tuned for the challenge number 6. Thank you.